Um, the first album I bought, I think it, it's either... I do remember buy, buying Britney's first album. So, what was it called? Baby One More Time. Yeah. Um, but I also, at the same time, got given Willennium on um, cassette because I really wanted that too. The first song I fell in love with... Oh, that's hard. Uh, do you know what? My brother really loved... This is a bit of a random choice. Wonderwall. Um, and that was like, well, Aces of Massive when I was a kid. And I, I just remember that loving that song so much. So probably that one. There are so many songs I wish I'd written. Um, I wish... What's a good one? I really wish I'd written Black Magic. Blood Little Mix. <laughs> It's so good. And I'd be rich as well if I'd written it. Um, the song I can't get out of my head. This is a really weird one, but for some reason, there are two songs that are always in my head, and one of them is Mel C and Brian Adams. Um, a baby, when you're gone. Don't know why. Um, and also, um, Unbreak My Heart. Those are my two songs that are in my head. <laughs> the song that makes me want to dance is... Millionaire, Khalees, and Andre 3000. That's one of my favourite songs, and whenever it comes on, I just, like, feel, you know, I want to start moving. <laughs> and I know all the words, so it helps. Ah, uh, song that makes you cry. Probably Morning Theft by Jeff Buckley. It's, like, on, I think, the second CD on Ske Sketches for My Sweetheart, The Drunk. That makes me... That makes me sad. The song... That I want played at my funeral. I'll just quickly tell you, my mum told me she wanted What a Wonderful World played at her funeral. <laughs> that, that is, that's dark, mum. For my funeral, I would like, um, I will survive Gloria Gaynor. <laughs> I don't tend to do karaoke, but the last time I did karaoke, I um, went for Dirty Christina Aguilera. Um, the artists that made me want to make music. There's so many, I think, stuff. Stevie Wonder was the reason I wanted to be a singer. Um, and then I fell in love with like girl groups like TLC and Destiny's Child. And then Jeff Buckley and Joni Mitchell were like the lyrical geniuses that made me want to like write music and write songs. I really like to play Little Dragon before we go on stage. Usually Ritual Union era or earlier. Um, just because, or anything actually, anything a little dragon, because we're all really big fans in the band, and um, it's sort of like not too aggressive. It's you can sing along, and yeah, it's just it's a nice vibe before you go on.